Okay, guys, check this out. So, uh, this is my very first True Cross build. Um, this is actually our, our team drone, Action Racing Squad, that we had. Um, we actually have these made up out of Japanese carbon fiber. Um, and the reason I built this was because I wanted a, a good platform for my sessions. Um, it called for 20 millimeter standoffs, but I slammed it down on 10 millimeter standoffs. But um, the main thing I want you to notice is um, this GoPro is just strapped on there with no foam or anything. We had the, the little strap things made in there. Um, so it sits on there perfect with just a Velcro strap. And... Um, so we're going to go out and uh, I'm going to take it for a fly for its very first uh, voyage. I've never flown a, um, a pure cross before. So we'll see what happens. Let's go check it out. Okay, well my plan was to go out to uh, the edge of the city, um, this big field next to the train station that I usually test and tune in. but started to rain a little so I just went across the street here to this park to check this thing out I've never flown a, a pure X before and this is um my very first bat I hover tested it in the living room but that's it this is the very first battery I've flown through this thing uh, pure stock pids um, I just threw my rates in there that I normally run and um, just kind of cruising it around to, to listen for uh, see if I can hear any uh, D or P oscillations or anything like that um, Now I am running uh, The beta the newest beta flight 3.1 build on here And it's allowing me to run 8 kilohertz and 8 kilohertz with D shot 600 and uh, I'll tell you what this thing flies amazing on stock pits um, I like to do like these big swoopy turns here because then I can really hear the um, the D oscillations come out and then I do some sharp turns to, to try to shake some P's out of there and um, you can even see here I fall through my own prop wash a couple times and there's like nothing I mean there's I can hear just a very very little bit of D here and there and maybe just a touch of P and of course I'll tune it eventually but um if, whenever I have a new build I fly five or six packs through it on stock pids first off just to check it out and get the feel for it that and the motors are gonna loosen up a little as as um as the coils heat up and, and the bearings start to break in a little bit and stuff like that so I like to fly it around a little bit until I tune and before I tune the pids to really get a feel for it and get everything broke in but like right here you can see I fell through my own prop wash and hit the throttle and there was like nothing and like I showed you in the beginning this GoPro is just strapped right to the frame there's no padding or anything under this so I'm amazed at how good this thing flies on hmm definitely different pretty cool